Okay, so the first thing you need to do is identify purposes. Why do we need information? What decisions do we need to make? And what information do we need to make the decision? So, for example, you may have something like daylight, health and well-being. And one of the requirements for that is to work out how much daylight you're getting into a room. In order to work that out, you then need to know, do we have enough windows? And is the glazing size adequate for the daylight within that room? Part of that would then be objects. So you'd need what the objects are. So you've got the room objects, and that would have default properties from bin models such as IFC or COBE, so areas, dimensions, parameter, which would be standard things associated with it. Windows will have a, a series of dimensional and other properties associated with them. And then the same with things like doors. Um, and then from that, you then get the functions. So basically, how do you calculate the things? So we'd need to calculate how many windows and the area of glazing to work out what the daylight is coming in from that. Um, you also get things that are called derived properties where maybe they're calculated from two existing. So the height and the width could give you the area as the derived property. So the properties themselves, some of them will be bespoke, um, but a property will have things like a unit of measure against it so you can actually work out what the that's in millimeters heights wherever so you then know what to do with the the sum of it you've got the default one so height and width but actually something like glazed area may not be a standard property on a window from ifc so therefore you need to include that so these are sort of things you need to work out what you need to calculate based on the purposes and the functions that you need to undertake Perfect. Thanks, Paul.